CS3 Professional. And it's on how to add backgrounds. The first thing you want to do is to get a sprite. And what I'm having, what I have up right now is the mysticalforestzone.com. After you type in the mysticalforestzone.com, which I have a link on the bottom, uh, you should have all this up right here. And you click on sprites, and you go to the first one. <coughs> click on the backgrounds. Go to the first one. to sample pictures click on but don't double click on it right click open with paint and then click blend the dotted the dotted lights instead okay now scroll to the bottom tricky part. Well, not the tricky part, but it takes a few steps. Okay, click on layer 1, double click on the text, backspace, the name of the background. <coughs> click on insert layer. Click on the layer, the text, double click it, backspace, the name of the sonic. select Sonic and the frames over here. Well, we want to get Sonic on the Sonic layer. And how we do that is you select Sonic. Select Sonic. Cut. Select on the Sonic layer. the bitmap. Now we can remove the white background. So double click on it, cut it, and go to scene one again. Okay, now we drag it to it. We resize it. It should be able to. And also, this is not part of it of the tutorial but if you're wondering how I got the green lines right here you go to and uh, you go to view you see rulers you check that off see right here rulers and then you 
dragon right here. Dragon ruins. Very simple. Makes it much easier. You drag it. This is NDS Master signing off and I hope this tutorial helped.